Newborn screening is done for babies shortly after birth to look for serious diseases that are treatable. The goal of newborn screening is to find babies with these diseases before they get sick. Early detection of these diseases through newborn screening can prevent serious health problems and save lives. In Ontario, newborn blood spot screening is coordinated by Newborn Screening Ontario, which is located at the Children's Hospital of Eastern Ontario in Ottawa. Healthcare providers across the province collect a small amount of blood from a baby's heel shortly after birth. The blood is sent to Newborn Screening Ontario, where it is tested for a panel of diseases, including metabolic diseases, endocrine diseases, sickle cell disease, cystic fibrosis, and severe combined immune deficiency, or SCID. Every year, more than 140,000 babies are born in Ontario, and around 200 babies each year are diagnosed with a disease through newborn screening. Every week, Newborn Screening Ontario receives about 3,000 samples. All samples are processed and tested urgently to look for newborns who are at risk for the serious diseases tested. The process starts with the arrival of the sample, where laboratory technicians check for test quality and that the requisition form is complete. A unique barcode is applied to each sample and requisition form. If a sample is not of high enough quality for accurate testing, a new sample is requested. Laboratory technicians prepare samples for testing by punching small circles of the blood sample into specialized testing plates that also contain quality control materials. This allows Newborn Screening Ontario to ensure the accuracy and quality of every test. The laboratory technicians and technologists prepare the samples for testing. This can take up to several hours from start to finish. Biochemical tests are used for most diseases. A few DNA-based tests are done on some babies for certain diseases. Laboratory technologists use a variety of testing instruments to analyze hundreds of newborn samples at the same time. These testing instruments include mass spectrometers, automated amino assays, automated enzymatic assays, high-performance liquid chromatography, and real-time polymerase chain reaction, or PCR. At the same time that the samples are being prepared for testing, data entry clerks enter the baby's information from the requisition into the laboratory computer system to be linked to the baby's results. Once the samples are prepared for testing, most of the testing instruments run overnight, so the results are available first thing in the morning. In the morning, laboratory technologists review the quality controls and standards for each test. The results are then reviewed and accepted by the laboratory director. The results can be screen positive or screen negative. Positive screens are confirmed different ways, including retesting by the original method or by more specialized tests for the disease. Once a baby is confirmed to be screen positive, a report is issued by the laboratory director and a genetic counselor or nurse refers the baby urgently to a specialty clinic in a hospital as close to the baby's home address as possible. Specialists will work with the baby's healthcare provider to review the results with parents and arrange for follow-up testing as quickly as possible. Once a diagnosis is confirmed, these specialists continue to provide care for the baby. Newborn Screening Ontario works closely with birth hospitals, midwifery practices, and disease specialists to ensure that every newborn receives the highest quality screening and care for serious diseases. Newborn Screening Ontario is a global leader in screening through research, development, education, and innovation. For more information about Newborn Screening Ontario, please visit www.newbornscreening.on.ca or follow us on Twitter at NBS Ontario.